What's up everyone, this is your boy Mal here, and today I'm going to be showing off my Christmas presents. So without further ado, let's get started. First thing I'm going to show off is this custom homebie Murdoch that I got off of eBay. Uh, I did consider getting the original, but as you may know, the official Hornby Murdoch is very expensive, and so I went for this little custom one, which is a Trapmaster Thomas face. I might uh, give this some more. I might add some lighting to this in the future to make it a bit more detailed. And uh, here's Tender, before I forget to show it off. Uh, it also has the BR logo on it. Which uh, isn't present on the official Hornby Murdoch or the or in the TV series since Murdoch never wore the BR logo. Up next we have the first thing I unwrap, which is a Trapmaster 2009 Steffi. I came with another fuel tanker. I will also be using this for a custom Trapmaster box hill, which you will also be seeing in my remake of the Railway Series book, Thomas and the Great Railway Show. I also thought I should do it since I also made a Fen Church as well. Up next we have another push on Shane and another push along Raji if the camera will focus. There you go. Uh, another Trapmaster Dart. I will be using this for a custom Trapmaster Ernest the Engine car. A extra boco. I'll be using this for a custom of Roderick, aka D5701. Another Trammaster Dent. I also bought this for the purpose of making a custom Trammaster Fred, and then I'll have all the Scarlet Rally engines that were in the Railway series. And it might appear at the Audric, at the next Audric Stravaganza in July at the Tallinn Railway, so who knows? Another Tommy Bill. Another Tommy Bill that I bought for the purpose of making a custom Trapmaster Pug. Also, a cup also many years ago, I once put black lay dough over my old Toby build to make it look like Pug. And that mop was the one that would later become Wilbert. I also had no Toby Ben at the time and I wouldn't get Ben in Trapmaster until 2013. Two Plero Oligar Railway Jameses. I also bought one for the purpose of making a custom trumps to Carlos and over there are the coaches push along Rocket Thomas Backman see a churro which I saw in as a National Museum and I thought hey I should get that for Christmas another capture play rail van Capsule Player Royal Cattle Truck. Uh, two Capsule Player Royal Splatters. I got those so that I could make them into the Blitzer Twins. Also, that one right there is missing a front coupler, which broke off. Plus, I also got a Capsule Player Royal Splatter back in 2019. A, a Capsule Player Royal Dodge, a, a Capsule Player Royal Diesel 10. This is also the second one I got. Uh, this was this one I got off of Turtles and Thomas back in February before he left the fandom and Technical Society closed down. But if you're on Twitter, you probably might have already known that. 
also got these two plushies, uh, Puffing Parson, a book called Puffing Parson, the Branch Line Miss Ministry, I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, the 2022 annual. This, uh, old Thomas annual, uh, what year was this from? Uh, hold on, uh, God, uh, uh, I'm gonna assume it's the, uh, oh, it was 986. Uh, okay. The snow surprise. Last train for Christmas, uh, the snowy special, this Disney family calendar, and last but not least, here is all the old media stuff that I got. So we have the Mud Glorious Mud DVD, uh, which is currently playing on the television right now. Thomas and his friends get along, which came with a pamphlet. A friend of mine also had this DVD. <coughs> Sorry about the cough, I am um, sick. Uh, engines to the rescue. I got this to replace my childhood copy because I lost it. Thomas Comes to Breakfast, another Thomas Adventures, the Canadian one. Finding Dory, the slip cover. Early Man. The biggest of a Christmas collection VHS, which is the first, as well as being the first Thomas VHS that I've gotten in uh, about four years since I got the VHS of the chocolate, the chocolate version of stories. And plus, I do remember seeing a bit of this at my primary school, but all I took home from it was that Thomas the Person's Good Adventure and Sleeping Beauty were on the song. No, on the VHS off of it. And I didn't really get to see the song, Thomas's Christmas Song, until I start, until I saw T, until I saw Speaker's Team Productions as adaptation of Thomas and the Missing Christmas Tree. Uh, and plus, let me take the little thing out. Uh, there's also something that I didn't realise. Came with this song sheet. Uh, as well as a bigger version of the. Uh, as well as a bigger version of the video cassette. And yeah, let me put this, pull this back up and put it back in the case. Dalmatian Vacation, one of the uh, one of the only two UK home releases for 101 Dalmatians series, which I want to be honest, both this and 101 Dalmatian Street honestly need more recognition because not many people acknowledge it exists. And lastly, Thomas and his friends help out. This one was scratched, and so my dad bought me a new one with uh, Thomas gets tricked. Oh, I uh, completely forgot. I also got the Trains and Cranes Super Tower set as well. And yeah, that is basically everything I got for Christmas 2021. Thank you all for watching, and have a great Christmas. And yeah.